guys, it's Cassie. Welcome to my channel if you're new. Welcome back if you're a seasoned subscriber. Today, we are going to be doing another come online luxury shopping with me. We go through some sites, we peruse, we see if there's stuff to add to the wish list, we see if there's stuff to add to cart. Guys, if you are new here, my name is Cassie. I'm a self-diagnosed luxury addict. I put out videos on Wednesdays and Fridays, sometimes Mondays. So if you like luxury fashion, then you're probably gonna love it here. So head down there, subscribe, turn on the bell, become a member of our luxury addicted family. When are we going to rehab? <gasps> Never. Guys, are you ready? Let's go. We might be buying some stuff today. We might just be sharing our opinions on what ridiculous stuff we find, or we might be adding stuff to the wish list. Which brings us to today's sponsor. Today's sponsor is no stranger to the channel. That is ShopTagger. This is their second time sponsoring. Thank you so much, ShopTagger. We love ShopTagger on this channel. I am currently using ShopTagger to hunt down the most glorious, incredible gold chain chunky necklace that is the most me thing I've ever seen. Um, so I am using ShopTagger to let me know when that is back in stock on my favorite sites. And guess what? I'm gonna get in, I'm gonna get the necklace, I'm gonna get out. So with ShopTagger, you can save your favorite items into a list. You can organize your shopping as you wish. And basically it will let you know when things go on sale or come back into stock. So you're going to head over to shoptagger.com. You're going to click this button to download it for free. Yes, it is 100% free. Then you're going to click to download it and add it to your Chrome as an extension. So you're going to go ahead and download that. Then you're going to create an account on ShopTagger and then guess what, bada bing, bada boom, you have it. So you basically travel to one of your favorite online retailers and when you see an item that catches your eye, tickles your fancy, you're gonna click this little S and then you can specify if you want it to let you know when it's at a certain percentage of discount or you want to know any price change and then you can go ahead and add it to one of your lists. I'm going to show you my 2020 wish list. My gosh, it keeps growing. You can organize your lists in whichever ways you want. You can have one for shoes, one for bags, a general wish list like I do. It just really helps you plan and organize your shopping a little bit more. Another fun thing that ShopTagger does is that when you're at checkout, this little friend pops up and he goes ahead and checks all of the discount codes that could apply to this order, okay? You go ahead, you click him, he scours the internet to see if there's anything that might apply. And if it does, it adds the coupon code. ShopTagger is also launching a cashback option, so keep your eyes open for when that comes out. So check out the link in the description box. Go ahead and download ShopTagger. Start putting some lists together. Start shopping smarter. Thank you, ShopTagger, for sponsoring this video. Let's kick it off with Moda Operandi. Now, it is sale season, okay? And Moda Operandi has just started their sale like this week, I think, so let's head over to the sale. Let's see what goodies we can find at a discount. Can we talk about these, like, weird summer shoes? Okay, these Cult Gaia Eden leather sandals, okay? The sandal part isn't the offensive bit. The heel is the bit that's just like, why? I mean, no wonder they're in the sale. This Jacquemus straw tote I have seen in a number of sales. So if you're after it, it is going for a good price, my friends. We need to have a chat about this Paco Rabanne sequined chainmail mini dress. I actually have zero questions as to why this has ended up in the sale, okay? because let's just, let's just dissect this um, sort of disco ball looking moment. That just to me looks straight up uncomfortable, okay? You're gonna be rustling and jingle jangling everywhere and everyone can hear you from five miles away that, oh, she's on her way, she's wearing her sodden pack of dress, dingle dangling around the roads, right? You're gonna be causing a commotion wherever you go, and not in a good way. Oh, it just, it just doesn't make any logistical sense to me. Though I do very much approve of the fact that the model here is wearing the um, Alexander Wang Reva sandal, which you would have seen in my alternatives to the basics video, and I highly approve. So, shoes, yes. The dress, the thing that we're actually here for, that's on discount, because it should be, it should be, it should be on actually, mm, it's on 50%, it needs to be on 75. Mm -mm. Okay, another Jacquemus piece that has made it into the sale, the little La Boite checked leather bag let's see it i mean it's so cute it's 40 percent off it's now 328 and it's not even like a mini mini bag i think that this needs to be given a chance i mean oh though imagine that cross body just sort of just sort of leaning on the body you've got like a you know the entire diameter of the of the little hat box that's annoying isn't it it's really not much of a cross body moment it is more of a top handle but, um, you know, she's cute, she's a little statement. A 
cannot stand these tiny sandals. This little tiny kitten heel sandal. I need to know the person that wears these tiny little kitten heel sandals clip clopping about. There's no point. There is no point in this. There is no situation in which a, I mean, what is that? A sort of 75% of an inch. Nobody's gone, you know what? Let's bring the kitten heels out. And then what's worse is that they're in sandal formation. You know, like pointed ones with a little thing. Like I can kind of, I can't get behind kitten heels in general. But those ones I can kind of like get the vibe. A sandal version, ugh. Oh, take it off and have a flat sandal, my gosh. Okay, this piece is an essential, a must have. If you can get it on discount, it's even better. And this is 30% off, okay? This is 61 pounds for a pair of the Espadrille brand, okay? The only Espadrilles to have, the Espadrille brand, Castanier. I think that's how you pronounce the N with the squiggle on top, okay? I have these, but with the toes out. But if you're looking for a classic, I mean, just look at them on the model, perfection. Absolute perfection. I'll be surprised if they've got all sizes. Okay, only the small sizes, but perfect. Absolute must have for the summer months. So Castanier is the, it's the Espadrille brand, let me tell you. This is interesting. Oh, it's a bit too eight, it's a bit too sixties for me, that pattern there. <gasps> okay. This dress might ring a bell and it might be because it was worn on our girl Lady Gaga at the Met Ball okay and I'm sorry if you can have a piece of the Met Ball if you can have a piece of the Met Ball but once again another thing COVID-19 has robbed us of the Met Gala I mean there you go it's 40% off Lady it's good enough for Lady Gaga it's good enough for us it's hot pink, it's cute, it's Barbie vibes. It's, I mean, it's it's a classic piece with a pop in the color. Brandon Maxwell, give it to me. Um, sadly got nowhere to wear that to and it doesn't work for my lifestyle, but if it does for you, please, please, I'm begging you. These are cute. You know how I feel about Aquazura shoes. Um, oh, I mean, look at those. They look like little chandeliers on your feet. Love her. Um, got some little, oh, you've got diamantes, you've got pearls, mm, serving us a moment, simple classic sand, black sandal, but with a little, little bit of, little bit of zhuzh, you know, and that is fabulous, love those, this is kind of chic, okay, this is this Balmain belted double breasted wool blend to wrench, <sighs> I mean, it's, it's very nice, and you can tell that it's fabulously made and everything else, but it's not giving me the fire, you know, so, just head on back there. <gasps> I love this dress. I love this dress. This is a Zimmerman embroidered button detailed Rami, Rami mini dress. Mm. Let's see it on the model. Beautiful. <gasps> this, these are the pieces I love from Zimmerman. They've got a high neck. That sleeve, that effing sleeve, it's got the skinny wrist and then the balloon shoulder. I live the embroidery, the little kind of, the detailing around the waist where you can kind of see skin but it's not too much. I live for this. This is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. This on a sweltering summer's night where you go for a romantic dinner by the dock. I don't know, I'm making this up. I don't know what it is. It makes me, it gives me like, that kind of top half is very kind of regal to me and I just... I live for it and I think that this is so beautiful. Switching gears. What the hell is this? Okay. I know that I have my fair share of weird and wonderful bags and we love unique pieces, right? Then there's something like this, which to me is neither unique enough to be fun like this is unique but it's not fun in the slightest it's on the model it's not helping it this is the thing and i know that i'm biased towards brands that i love as we all are but i kind of think victoria beckham did anyone ask you for handbags when was the last time you saw a handbag on instagram or in a magazine and you're like oh, look at this fabulous bag let me see who it's by. And you tap for tags, or you look at the little detail section, and it says 
Victoria Beckham. No, no one, no, no. There is no recent memory or any memory of that because nobody's done it, because nobody's actually turned to Victoria Beckham for bags. We're good, we're good, please. Your brand seems to be doing very well. You do great trousers and ready to wear. Um, we didn't need the bags, we really didn't. Okay, this is very sad um, because uh, I bought this and now it's in the sale. So that's always a sad moment when that happens, isn't it? Um, it will be featured in an upcoming haul, but I do have this in the white. Um, and this is the Aisla Lewis Cotton Mini Shirt Dress. Let me tell you a little bit something about this dress. When you just look at the product picture, you're like, mm. but when you see this on the model, so freaking cute, okay? And the best thing, what I love about this dress as well, is that you could definitely put this with, <gasps> with my Chanel white and blue sneakers, you could nail it with that, or you could do it with um, like this, dressed up for, you know, a fancy dinner or whatever. <gasps> we love, we love, we stand. I mean, what is this? Ghani leather mini dress. It's probably a sentence that shouldn't exist. Okay, you know what? It's not that bad. And I actually think in the winter, exactly, you could put it with tights and you'd be good. That would be cute. Okay, fine. I take it back. I take it back. Let's do a bit of far fetch, shall we? I am a far fetch fan. Usually, if I can't find anything anywhere, I go to far fetch and I find it. And they are also doing a sale. Shop the best of the season. Clearly not the best because it's in the sale, but I get what you say. Okay, again, we're gonna give this a couple of pages, we're gonna see what there is. I'm not gonna whittle down by designer, I'm just gonna see see what there is. Batman logo t-shirt. Off-white surf, 100 millimeter pumps. <sighs> the model absolutely nails it. On first look, I was like, meh. And then I saw it on the model and I was like, damn, she's killing it with her all leather look. I mean, they're interesting, they're different. If you're gonna get them, get them 40% off, you know? Moschino bat teddy print shirt. Look, I used to be a really huge Moschino fan because I really liked the novelty behind it and like the cute, you know, whatever. Now I'm just like, it's just not, I'm not here for the, for the novelty so much, you know? This bat teddy bear really tells me everything I need to know. This. Did the design team not know that this would go straight into sale? It's it's a teddy bear wearing a bat costume. How many people are going to buy this t-shirt? Tell you what, I bet all the sizes are there. But all the sizes are there, aren't they? 40% off. Well, needs needs a couple more tens of percentage off that. Okay, this I think is very nice. This is the off-white Intarsia knit logo dress. And I think that this is absolutely fabulous. Oh, it's got a sodding back cut out. Take it back. Ugh, I had to go and ruin it. Wow, another piece I own. Straight in the sale. How dare you? Rude. My Rotate Carol Crystal Embellished Blazer Dress. I'll put up a picture of me wearing it and absolutely slaying it. And would I recommend it? Yes. Okay, it's very comfortable made a statement and you can now get it 40% off so good for you let's go to let's finish off with some essence essence is, is I find it like a, a lovely weird little luxury online retailer they always have the kind of little bit more street wary a little bit more like weird and wonderful pieces that I appreciate so let's hit up the sale there as well thank you so much I feel like they will definitely have some uh, interesting pieces hmm straight from the get-go we've got something to talk about push button green one leg trousers i would absolutely love it if somebody told me a, <laughs> a reason or situation in which wearing these trousers would be a moment a look or indeed necessary in any which way what makes it worse to me is when they've paired it with the top because it just looks even more ridiculous than it was before. Oh my gosh, that's 34% off. My gosh, that needs to be 90% off and even then you couldn't pay me to wear that. Why? I feel like I just have a general problem with this brand. This is the first time hearing about this brand and um, 
this no this 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 is not classified this is the beige skirt shorts no no mm -mm, mm -mm. i'm sorry what's happening here what's this what's this I'm assuming that this just isn't because the only size they had was a 42 and the model was a 37. I think that this might actually be the, the, the design. Is that the front of the shoe extends past the toes. I can't imagine that that's like a very comfortable walking experience, right? I do very much like this t-shirt and I know that this is a very random choice. But I don't know, I really like the wings on the shoulder situation. I think it's like very simple, but something exciting at the same time. Marcelo, Berlon County of Milan. Thank you so much. Let me know what you thought about what we saw today. Let me know if anything tickled your fancy. Make sure to check out Shop Tagger in the description box below. Download it, create some lists. Guys, I'm going to link to another video here in case you haven't already seen it and you're not quite finished with me. Have an amazing morning, afternoon or evening wherever you are and I will see you in the next video. Mwah. Bye guys.